before we head down to the field for the coin toss, we'd like to remind you this game is brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coke taste, zero calories. Enjoy everything. The kickers got the ball set up, and we're ready to get this thing started. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. He's to the 40. Makes it out to about the 46. Just a simple draw play there, but they picked up some big yards. From their own 46-yard line, first down. Nice run there. They'll drop him for a loss. So they wrapped him up before he could get anything going. Yeah, there was nothing there on that option. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 44. Push him out at the 19-yard line. Now it's first and ten with a defense trying to regroup after giving up the big pass. The 10, and he's level at the 8-yard line. They're eating up a lot of field on this drive. I'm really impressed with their ball control. The halfback with a carry. That's a great tackle at the 8. Maybe a yard on the run by the tailback. That brings him second and goal. It's second and goal, 8 yards out. Strike to the receiver, and they'll score. I like how the quarterback, the offensive line, and the receivers made a concerted effort to get into the end zone. Point. A nice seven play, 76 yard drive, and they put up seven points. So our score, seven nothing. They line up to kick this one away. Brought down at the 28 yard line. The Bulldogs and their ground game's always been sensational. It's not always one guy, Herbie. Sometimes they've got two or three that can carry the load. And that's what makes it so tough for this defense is you're not focusing in on just one guy. You're focusing in on really an entire scheme. And because of that diversity, I think it makes it more of a challenge. And you got to be better tacklers in the open field. And, and I think that's really what they've stressed all week is tackling and gang tackling and getting to the football. Hard to get to guys and make tackles in space. From their own 28-yard line. Second down. Five wide. Got it. And he goes down quickly. A five-yard gain. Here's a safe play hitting the underneath receiver, but it's a nice gain of five. That'll make it third and five. Now he 
he tries to buy some time. They bring him down. The defenders played the snap count perfectly. He found the path into the backfield and didn't let the quarterback get away. Excellent hook. He's tackled at the 39. Last time out, they were able to pick up big chunks of yards through the air. You wonder if they'll go back to that same strategy or will they start to lean a little bit more on their ground game. Gets out to around the 48. It's so it's second down and about two yards to go. Good outside run there. They'll get a first down there on the play with the run from the tailback. Good play here. Getting a new set of downs and keeping the run an integral part of this offense. Steam on that throw, and he's tackled right away. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. Fires quickly to the tight end. Tackled at about the 39-yard line. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. Stays in bounds and made a nice catch. Boy, when you can rely on your tight end to move the chains, you've got a big time advantage over any defense. situation here. It's second down and one. And they'll bring him down behind the line. This defensive lineman's got the kind of size and strength where he can disrupt the play all by himself. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wideouts. Slings it. And he's taken down at the 14. There are three quarters remaining. The Golden Eagles with a touchdown lead. That makes it first and ten. And we're back for more action here in quarter number two. With room to work. He's out of bounds right around the 10 yard line. That makes it second and six. From the 10 yard line. Second down. There's a strike complete. Dives forward. It's the 11th play of the drive. And they're in. Touchdown.
great job of finding the space to run and just bursting in for six. And he adds the extra point. It was an 11-play, 59-yard drive. And they add seven points to the scoreboard. You know, Brad, a lot of times you have to watch practice and watch a seven-on-seven -seven drill to not see the ball touch the ground. But this time, they went the entire length of the field. The ball never touched the ground. Great execution by the quarterback and the receiver. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He makes it out maybe to the 26-yard line. It was a pretty one-sided first quarter, but I wouldn't be surprised if things changed in a big way before halftime. Makes it to the 34. That makes it second and two. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. He's at midfield. They'll bring him down around the 36-yard line. So they pick up big yards on the option keeper. I thought he's going to break that one for a touchdown. You couldn't draw that up any better. He makes it out to maybe the 33-yard line. From the 33-yard line, second down. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. There's a player down. I'm not sure what happened. And they push him out around the 15-yard line. Quarterbacks just love this scenario. He had his man one-on-one -on, -one on a corner route versus man coverage. And you just saw it. It results in an easy first down. First and 10. Ball on the 15. He's on the run. Decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. Tackle made at the five-yard line. And he's tackled at the four. Here's the eighth play of the series. one probably should have been picked off. Yeah, are you kidding me? There's a blanket around that receiver. Somebody else had to be open. Here we go, folks. Third and goal from the four. Fakes to the back. Brought down around the one-yard line. Three, maybe four yards on a scramble. The Bulldogs lost a player to an earlier injury, and unfortunately, it doesn't look like he's going to be able to come back today. All the big boys are on the field now. Both teams have their big set, and it pays off. Touchdown. When you're that close to the end zone, it's always a smart play to find your blockers and follow them into the end zone. He makes the PAT. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. He's tackled at the 33-yard line. A nice job by the offensive line, and they pick up a gain of eight. About two minutes before halftime. He 
he's taken down around the 44-yard line. Zips it to the back. They bring him down in the backfield. That play was going nowhere. Yeah, give a lot of credit to the defense here, recognizing pass and swarming to the receiver. From the 44-yard line, it's second down. He fights forward to about the 43. Maybe a yard on that draw play. but it's incomplete. It can be tough making a play on the ball sometimes, but that's probably a pick he should have made. Just a minute to go in the first half of play. The punter is going to try to pin him deep in their own territory with a good punt here. And this one is a beauty. So this one goes into the end zone, and that'll be a touchback. It's early in this game, so the defense can still have an opportunity to make some adjustments. But if things don't turn around in a hurry, it's really going to start to affect the psyche of that defensive line. He's going to try and scramble. He's out to the 30, and he hits him hard at the 37. The Bulldogs taking their first time out of the half. From their own 37-yard line, it's first down. The Bulldogs use their second timeout. The halfback picks up a yard. And a quick throw. And they make the stop around the 47-yard line. Scrambling around. Tackle at the 43-yard line. He's scrambling. And down he goes to 39 yard line. The quarterback trying to make a play. Well, he did a nice job of getting some yards here on the scramble, but he needs to learn to slide to avoid those big hits. The cavalry's coming. They'll make the sack. They get to the quarterback and end that play before it even got started. This young man didn't even have a chance to make something happen. It's tough to find your receivers when the defense is in your face like that. The Bulldogs using their third and last timeout. And they'll probably try to throw here as they line up on third down and 14. Well, after that injury, we'll get to see the backup quarterback here. He chucks it downfield. And this one's broken up. Number 19 was the intended receiver on the way. That'll make it fourth and 14. He sails it long. Incomplete. Almost picked off. We've still got a half of football remaining. Golden Eagles with a touchdown lead. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Chris Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. A tight, hard-hitting, low-scoring affair. Great hey, affair. This, this Great. Is right, you can say it like it is. This is right in your wheelhouse, Pollock. I mean, this, this is exactly in your comfort zone. No, absolutely. I mean, you like to see people flying around. You like to see defenses dictating to offenses and make them play on our terms. And it's it's fun to watch. It's something that as a great every great defense prides themselves prides themselves on tackling. 
You know, you didn't see very many missed tackles in the first half that led to big plays. And try to limit those big plays. And when they do get down towards the red zone, make people kick field goals. And that's that's how you see dominant defenses year in, year out. And, and that's what we're seeing today. David and I will stay locked in on everything going on in college football. It's going to wrap it up here in the studio. Just about time to get you out to your second half. Brad and Kirk ready with a call. All right, Reese and David, thanks, guys. Second half action, just about ready to start here. Gets to about the 27-yard line. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense, as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. And he throws it away. Second and ten. Ball on their own 27. Steps out of bounds. Right around the 30. The Bulldogs lost one of their key guys earlier to that injury, and unfortunately, I don't think he's going to play any more football today. Green here, and the halfbacks got it. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. They'll bring him down at the 33. They'll take over here, ready to start a new series. He makes it out to maybe the 36-yard line. From their own 36-yard line, it's second down. Tackle and a decent pickup. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. And they get nice yardage on that run. From their own 24-yard line, second down. And they'll get him in the backfield. Good job by the defense to overpower the offensive line and drop the back for a loss. Shot to the open receiver, and he can't hang on to the ball. Number nine, he intends to receive it right away. That'll bring up fourth and nine.
He really got a hold of that one. He's taken down to the 38-yard line. The defense did a nice job shutting down the offense the last time they had the ball. Nice run to the outside. From their own 42-yard line, second down. He's at midfield. He makes his way to about the 45. it to the 37. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Makes it to the 17. There's nothing more effective that a team can do offensively than to pound the ball right at the defense, trying to wear them down. yard line it's first down and they'll be looking for six points here job inside the red zone of mixing up the play calling that touchdown obviously fooled the defense he splits the uprights with the extra point a six play 63 yard drive and they put up seven points and Brad right now the offensive line just winning the battle in the trenches opening up some big running runs. looks like they're ready for the kick made at the 31. The Golden Eagles continue to get it done on the defensive side of the football, Kirk. Yeah, they've done a good job of building this lead and almost determined here to protect it. Let's see if they can hold on here for the rest of the way. The defense really stepped up to force that three and out on the last drive. Down two possessions. This offense has to step up and capitalize on this possession. That's a great tackle at the 32-yard line. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 32. Let's it fly. It's caught first down and he's out of bounds. First and ten. Ball on the 46-yard line. Give to the tailback, and he's met in the backfield. The defense was able to get really good penetration and drop him short of the line of scrimmage. senior and he scores touchdown and he adds the extra point
The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Wow, close game here. And up and down the field with both these offenses matching what the others done. Well, it's fun to watch each offense get an opportunity to go out and make plays. And you're right, you almost feel as, as if one offense feels challenged and has to be able to bounce back, and they've done that. So it's time to see this offense go to work again. This defense couldn't stop them from moving the ball and inevitably finding the end zone. Here's a draw. Tackle made at the 22. That brings up second and 13. So at the end of three. The Golden Eagles lead 21-14. Back in this very pivotal fourth quarter. Makes the catch and look out. He's pushed out of bounds at the 27 yard line. That's good for the game. Five yards. That'll bring up third and eight. From their own 27 yard line, it's third down. He goes out of bounds at the 34. Puts it away, and it's a great kick. And he's taken down at the 23-yard line. This is a pretty crucial series right here. With things being so tight, your best players have to step it up on both sides of the ball. They'll work the right side. He makes it to the 25-yard line. Second down, eight yards to go. Ball on the 25-yard line. Decent run here, right side. Bring him down around the 43 yard line. He really wanted that ball, didn't he, Kirk? Now, you can't teach hustle like that. The linebacker was determined to get the ball there, and he did. You know, this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Gaining five yards. That brings him second and five. From the 38-yard line, second down. He's on the run, and he's tackled the 37-yard line.
Hawkins hit before he can go anywhere. From the 23-yard line, first down. Just over two minutes in the game. So not only did they risk an interception, but now they've given them more time. I just don't get it. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 23. Little handoff. And he carries the ball for a nice game. The Bulldogs taking their first time out of the half. It's another carry. The five, and it pays off. Touchdown. They didn't snap the ball in time. Delayed game, offense. Just under two to go in the game. And he hits the PAT. kick plenty of distance he's to the 20 and down he goes at the 23 golden eagles have really been all over the place they're playing like a defense possessed i love to watch a defense just pin its ears back and just fly to the football they are playing with a reckless attitude and it's really paid off because it's set up their offense to be able to score points this offense was infected by the turnover bug their last time out let's see if they can hold on to the ball here Defense, I'm sure, will be aggressive again. They love going for the strip and attacking the football. Absolutely perfect call by the defensive coordinator. He brought just the right amount of pressure from the right direction, and it seemed to confuse the offense. Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun, five wide receivers. There's a strike complete. Knocked out of bounds around the 37-yard line. That makes it first and ten. It's first and ten. Ball on the 37-yard line. The lineman got a little ahead of the snap count. Here's the call. Ball start. Ball start. Offense. Offense. That penalty will move him back a bit. Yeah, and with so many young guys out there, it's bound to happen occasionally. Pressure on the quarterback forced that incompletion. Boy, they really pounded him on that throw. Second down, 15 to go. Ball on their own 32. A little over a minute in the game. He airs it out. It's caught. And they make the stop at the 18. pressure quick throw oh what an interception i think you can start up the bus herbie this one's over with that interception right, right. 
First down, 10 to go. Ball on their own 20. Gets out to about the 21. And he gets a yard on the run. The Bulldogs use their second timeout. He's tackled right around the 24-yard line. Three-yard gain by the running back. One thing about this linebacker over the years that separates him from the rest are his instincts and ability to make the play. That's a nice tackle by the senior. Nice run, and he's brought down. And he is just shy of the first down mark. You know, this is really good effort on both sides of the ball. Tough running by the offense and great tackling by the defense. away and it's a booming punt so he managed to get a few yards on the run back yeah but I'll tell you Brad with so much traffic in the middle there it really makes it tough to break free you know the offense will be looking to do better this time out and we'll see how aggressive this defense is when they come back out I would be surprised if they kept up the pressure to try to cluster this quarterback some more fires out to his receiver and he tackles him hard at the 40 yard line and so that's going to do it our final score in this one 28 14 golden eagle thanks for joining us for another game of ncaa football 14 for kirk and everyone here at ea sports brad nestler saying goodbye and we'll see you next time